Hello, Beauty News family. Welcome back to the Makeup Breakup. It's Yay! been a while. But we're back and we're going to be testing out a thing that a brand said that a, a product that they make can do. So this is the Tarte Maracuja Miracle Mist. And we saw an image from Tarte when they released this product um, that, look. Too good to be true. Right. <laughs> Mate, it's a lot. It's it's some big claims. So essentially, uh, they show an image of two foundation swatches um, and a finger dragged through, presumably both, and one swatch has been sprayed with maracuja mist and one hasn't. But look, I think if you are somebody with eyes, you can probably tell that the finger has only been put into one swatch and dragged through. I agree. Um, but we love it when brands do this for us because it means we can make a video about it. We can call them out on their bullshit. Let's call it. <laughs> Look, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Look, we'll get in a nice close-up image for you and you can see... There is no way the finger dragged no, through both of them. There is no absolute no way. way. And also, like if you look at that that bottom swatch where the finger has been dragged through, you can literally see the point where the finger was placed yeah. on the swatch. <laughs> yeah. Like, and I'm I'm looking at a little photo on my phone right now. And if you're watching this on your beautiful big screen tv at home or on your nice big computer screen computer. yeah like you you can see it you can see it is can you hear it it's it's bullshit <laughs> <laughs> so essentially what they're trying to prove is that this is a waterproof product and it's supposed to set makeup for 16 hours yes now we're and not make it budge proof make it budge proof we're finger not proof yeah finger <laughs> proof we're not going to test the 16 hour claim no. because we can't be fucked we're tired yeah i um, don't care but we're going to test to see if spraying your makeup with this product sets it so much that the finger mark doesn't yeah go through which it which means if it does by the, the slight chance that it does. This means you can go out in public and let people swipe their finger on your Ugh. face. <laughs> Real life tindering. Yeah, exactly. I'm going to swipe right or swipe <laughs> left. Ew. Ew, Don't disgusting. let people touch you in public. No, <laughs> pandemic. Watch out, watch out. Um, but also what we might do, since this is supposed to set makeup waterproof, mm. we might chuck some water on it. Let's do it. And see if it is finger and waterproof. Yes. Here are some swatch guides that I prepared earlier. And here is a foundation from KVD Vegan Beauty. Kindness Vegan, vegan Beauty. beauty co co goodness. Something. Doing good. Doing good. That's right. <laughs> Doing good vegan beauty something. Um, now, the reason we chose this is one, um, it's sort of our makeup breakup foundation. Uh, but two, it's basically like paint, so it probably won't come off anyway. <laughs> True. But, yeah, this is a foundation that Haley had and no longer wants, so yep. it's, uh, we've donated it to the destruction gods. To the, to the cause. Not because we're saying this is a great foundation, because that's not the case. No. Um, it's literally it like paint. Try to get it a little bit even, get off any excess, because obviously it's not going to set if it's legitimately thick like paint. Let's see how beautiful and crisp my lines are. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, so satisfying. It is a bit satisfying, isn't it? That one's a bit wonk, but it doesn't matter. Nah, it's still crisp as crisp needs to be. Yes. But you I can see to... how thick that is. <laughs> oh, sorry. All right. Now I need something to cover the swatch that shouldn't have spray on it. And we're going in. Oh, 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 it's fucking wet. That, that comes out with a lot of product. It's going to take 20 years to dry. It's... Like beating up on the foundation because the foundation is. is really budge proof. 
Oh my lord. It smells like hairspray. It does. Also, it is a continuous mister, Oof. which is awesome. Um, all right, we'll be back in six hours when that's dry. All right, it's been about five minutes and the way I was sort of testing if it was dry was by touching the area around the swatches where I got the spray. That's been dry for ages, but these swatches both still look wet. Now I know this foundation doesn't actually like set down completely dry and matte on its own. Um, it needs to be set and that's what this is supposed to do apparently. Um, so we're just going to go for it. I think, shall we start over here and just like, yeah, let's, let's see. <gasps> Moment of truth. Yeah, nah. <laughs> that did nothing. It did, looked identical. It did absolutely nothing. Like they both moved the same bloody amount. Yep. Wet and sticky. Yeah. Wet and sticky. No difference. Well, at least you showed that where your finger collides with the foundation, yes. it leaves the same mark Actually, as that other swatch does. Yeah, yeah, we can very clearly see that where my finger has sort of dragged through and then here where it's dragged through again. Um, so, yeah. All right, let's see if it's waterproof. We're here to see these things. I mean, okay, so looks like... You know, it's beating up. That's good. Give it a little mushy mush. Oh, yeah. All right. So. It's still beating. It's not really it's mixing a, together. Yeah. It's not like breaking down the foundation too much. However, shall we point out that uh, that could simply be the foundation? Yeah. So we have to do a control test. What do you know? That looks even more waterproof. That's even better. <laughs> that looks like this one looked like it was sort of... Mixing a little bit more. Yeah, whereas this is like... Oh, look, guys. It's oh. called the BS and it is and, the BS. And uh, it's BS. That looks like it's lifted more than this. It does. Are you able to catch that on camera? <laughs> Hopefully. So this is a swatch that we sprayed and it looks like it has lifted quite a bit. Oh yeah, you can smooth it out again. It's still like, it feels tacky and wet and sticky just like the foundation does without the setting spray. Now I think it's fair to point out that these haven't been set with powder, which would totally make them a lot more budge proof, but the Tarte image clearly shows that the, they've not been set with powder. Um, you wouldn't be able to drag a finger through foundation and make it move like that if it was set with powder. Um, but I think maybe we should show you that if you're curious to see. All right, she's set with powder. I'm just gonna sit that over the top because I know it's not gonna transfer foundation everywhere and spray. This spray comes out super wet. I'm drenched. If you need a shower, just use this. One eternity later. All right, let's do it. Sprayed, not sprayed. It's the same. I don't, What? what is this? I know the first ingredient's water. To make it waterproof. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see if they're both waterproof. Mmm. <laughs> that one looks even more waterproof. I know, that's the thing that I find interesting about it. It is! <laughs> I don't think it is! It is! I like... That's hilarious. Are you, you've got that, yeah? Yeah. And look, that it's starting to get sort of like... Mixed into the foundation. Yeah, milky-ish. And this one's just like, nah. This is paint and Australis fresh and flawless powder. Locked in, mofo. 
Yeah, so the, the mist, we can conclude, actually makes it less waterproof. <laughs> it, doesn't, it doesn't. I don't get it. What did we learn? Well, we learned that, uh, firstly, the photo is definitely a lie. The photo is a lie. It the is mist is a my. A, 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 a lie. A, the mist <laughs> is a my. And... Um, if anything, it makes foundations less waterproof. Yes. It looked like that with the unset foundation and definitely with the set foundation. The water sort of pulled on top or blended yeah. on top rather than mixing it with the foundation. So this yeah. is actually degrading the foundation. Look, I've got no problem with tart, but I do have a problem with bullshit. And they're serving some right dog shit. This is some bullshit. <laughs> However, in saying all of that, this might be a nice finishing spray. Yeah. If you like it and you vouch for it, yeah. we're not saying that as a finishing spray it is bullshit. No. But the claims. Yeah, that picture is a lie. Yeah, and the waterproof <laughs> claim is Prob, a lie. Prob's not waterproof. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right, guys. We do hope you enjoyed this episode of The Makeup Breakup. If you did, give it a thumbs up and we're going to see you in the next one. Bye.